for thousands of dollars in instant cash prizes. Woohoo! Dizzy da da da, when you touch it, you can win it right away. Oh, shredded wheat, oh, shredded wheat, serve it hot for a tasty treat. Hot? Sure, you just pour hot water over Nabisco shredded wheat for a soft whole wheat breakfast treat. My brother likes to drown his shredded wheat. <laughs> Tonight. They fired her for being overweight. When... I'm not offensive. Who's at your fans? Kelsey and Markowitz clash. Your money, okay? For once in your life, stop pushing me, okay? What makes it different? Unique. L.A. Law. Gentlemen, ladies, you have before you the new sale price for our DQ home style single burger with lettuce and tomato. That's low. That's very low. That's really low. Can we do this? Mm -hmm. That's incredible. The Dairy Queen home style single burger with lettuce and tomato. On sale now for just 99 cents. We treat you right. From Touchstone Pictures, Adrian Cronauer is not just another DJ in Vietnam. To the soldiers, he's a hero. Where are you from? Oh, Cleveland, man. Hey, obviously, Vietnam's not that much of a change for you. To the Vietnamese, he's a friend. Slip me some skin. I hit yeah. To his superiors, he's a problem. What's he going to be like when he's ten times as popular? Robin Williams is Adrian Cronauer. Big dog landing on my face. In the Barry Levinson film, Good Morning Vietnam. Now playing at famous players and other theaters. No. Checking figures for showtimes. Right here is where almost half of all traffic accidents happen, at an intersection. And in more than 85% of the cases, the cause is driver error. Texaco believes the best way to stop this is better drivers. So starting now, Texaco will arrange for a 10% reduction in the cost of a Young Drivers of Canada course. It's all here in our free driver training kit. Pick up yours soon, or call our toll-free number. Please, let a professional teach them to drive and survive. Introducing Downy Sheep. At last, Downy Sheep. A whole new way to tumble in softness, plus the April freshness you can only get from Downy. Your family will love it. Who'd have thought you could get this much softness in a handy dryer sheet? New Downy sheet. Now you can tumble in April fresh softness like never before. Oh, 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 tumble in softness. New Downy sheet. Bank of Canada rate today fell to its lowest level in three months, down to 8.49 percent. The dollar, meantime, has resumed its climb against American currency. It gained a quarter cent on the day, closing at 79.15 cents U.S. That's its highest level in over four years. BRIC, the B.C. Resources Investment Corporation, reports heavy losses. It ended this past year $307 million in the red, and that's twice as large a loss as BRIC recorded in the previous year.
Air Canada to Europe. Death Daniel, Mia Farrow, in Purple Woes of Cairo. Madonna, desperately seeking Susan. Geraldine Green, Trip the Bounty, The Man from Snowy River, all coming here starting Sunday. Today is your day, my little girl. And this was your grandmother's. Very pretty. And very precious. I know. <laughs> and love will protect it. But it's thin. Wouldn't a thick diaper. Stop leaks better? Mm -mm. Look. Love holds wetness safely inside. No, wait. Go ahead. It didn't leak. And Love's snug waistband helps stop leaks here, too. So when you want to protect what's most precious, trust Love's. Are you happy with your wash? Looks good to me. What about close up? Look, your bargain detergent is short changing you on close up clean. You're not going to tell me there's a difference. All temperature cheer is different. Watch. Over time, bargain detergents let dirt build up. But with cheer, the shirt stays cleaner because cheer has 40% more cleaning ingredients. And now. Looks and smells really clean. Cheer for clothes that look and smell cleaner, even close up. Head and shoulders. I didn't know you had dandruff. I don't. Chances are you'll never see dandruff on someone who uses head and shoulders regularly. Head and shoulders? I didn't know you had dandruff. I don't. Because head and shoulders worries about your dandruff, so you don't have to. Head and shoulders? I didn't know you had dandruff. I don't. So don't have dandruff. Have great looking hair. World class to Europe and return with flying colors. Now, tonight's weather details. Here's Norm. Thanks, Tony. I missed uh, Ida Gaylord's birthday yesterday. It's kind of special because she was 107. So, uh, Ida Gaylord of Burnaby, all the best to you. Now, uh, what I wanted to show you on the satellite photo is that we have this conveyor belt here that uh, starts in Hawaii and goes all the way up to our British Columbia coast, and that's the conveyor belt upon which all this mild, moist air is uh, coming in. It's creating quite a lot of difficult situations in B.C. First of all, there is a heavy rain warning for the northwest end of Vancouver Island and from there northward on the coastal sections, up to 150 millimeters. Call that six inches of rain is expected in the next 24 hours. And somewhere between 10 and 20 centimeters of snow called for for the interior, and that could be anywhere from Prince Rupert uh, east to Prince George, and then from Prince George um, east up to uh, the Alberta border. The Department of Highways has advised that road closures and delays are in effect east of Revelstoke in the uh, Three Valley Gap area, the Pine Pass route between Prince George and Dawson Creek. So if you're heading that way by car, by all means, please check with the Department of Highways or the RCMP uh, before you uh, go east in British Columbia. And just for interest's sake, spotting a few locations in eastern Canada around um, Bay Como and Set Il. I don't know why I choose those places, but uh, I do. Uh, they're expecting snow with overnight lows of minus 26. And, and here we are going golfing tomorrow. I don't understand it. In Toronto this afternoon, minus 7. Snow is on the way. The remaining cool uh, air uh, is concentrating in southern Manitoba and southern Saskatchewan, although temperatures have risen for uh, about 10 degrees in the last 24 hours. In southern Alberta, it looks a little bit dicey for the opening of the Olympics. Some of the fears have come true. Not only Chinook mild weather, highs of 9 around Calgary, Lethbridge, and uh, Medicine Hat, the uh, Olympic corridor, but the winds are picking up to 50 kilometers an hour, and that's what's melting the snow. We'll keep you and the rest of the BCTV crew posted. There is um, a large uh, ridge of high, and it's centered in Utah, and uh, the northern end of it is just cut through uh, Juan de Fuca. Otherwise, our weather is going to be dominated by this large, warm low here, as I mentioned, it being generated all the way from Hawaii. Did you detect the pineapple juice in the rain today? Well, that's it, you see. Uh, this is carrying heavy rain for the central and north coasts, basically from the north end of Vancouver Island uh, northward. Uh, and as far as temperatures go, we had the warmest in the country today at Lytton, 13 degrees. And it looks like we're going to go through the weekend with this mild, moist air. The freezing level around Vancouver is 2,500 meters. The emphasis is on cloudy skies and rain. In Whitehorse, the first uh, recording area, 
or, or they're talking about a chance of light snow. Sunny periods tomorrow afternoon and overnight lows down to about minus 18. Maybe even minus 22 in Centerville and Watson Lake. For the Peace River country, occasional light snow, but very mild compared to the beginning of the week, uh, minus 3 and plus 2. For the caribou in the interior, intermittent rain or snow, heavier snow and freezing rain west of Prince George because daytime highs are up around 5, overnight lows 0 for the north coast. Rain mixed with snow, snow inland, windy on the coast, a 90 to 100 percent chance of precipitation, and mild. Thompson, Okanagan, West Kootenays, snow in the northern Thompson area, 10 to 20 centimeters, spotty precipitation in the south. East Kootenays, cloud with sunny breaks, 30 percent chance of precip. For the southwest corner of B.C., mainly cloudy, showers of uh, rain, which will be heavier at times, remaining very mild, not only tonight and tomorrow, but into the weekend as well from all of that system coming up from Hawaii. Thanks, Tony. Nine years ago today, supporters of the Ayatollah Khomeini overthrew the Shah of Iran, ending the 2,500-year-old Persian monarchy. And the anniversary celebrations in Iran today took many forms, including the bombing of a Norwegian supertanker in the Persian Gulf. The 290,000-ton Happy Carry was fully loaded with oil from Kuwait when Iranian gunboats struck and set it afire. The supertanker sent out distress calls, which went unanswered at first. Although five nations have warships in the area, they only protect their own tankers. Salvage tugs eventually put out the blaze after a four-hour fight. The Happy Carry had just re-entered the Gulf after spending three weeks undergoing repairs. It was on its first voyage since being hit by Iranian gunboats two months ago. One of the unofficial wonders of the world is falling to pieces. It is the huge sphinx which sits on Egypt's Giza Plateau near the famed pyramids. The limestone statue is the oldest and the largest of its kind, 20 meters high and 50 meters long. It has the body of a crouching lion and the face of a pharaoh, and it's more than 4,000 years old. But this week, a fierce sandstorm battered the Sphinx and the pyramids, and a huge chunk of the statue's shoulder simply crumbled away. The Egyptian government is studying the Sphinx now to discover how to save it. If you're looking for an RRSP, then look to the Bank of British Columbia. The Bank of BC offers you the highest interest rates on fixed-term redeemable RRSPs, higher than Canada's largest national banks, higher than Canada's major trust companies. The highest interest rates plus the complete flexibility of early redemption. The Bank of British Columbia has what you want most in an RRSP. Highest interest rates and greatest flexibility. Come in and talk with us. It's a famous name. Pizza fame. That wonderful food right to your door. And pizza you'll adore. We soon became the biggest, cause we know you want the best. In two for one, pizza fun, put our flavor to the test. Cause we got the faith. We got the faith. In our food. Yes, in our food. We bring it on home. Yeah. Bring it on home to you. And a couple of Woodward Showcase is a weekly publication that's attracting a lot of attention and curiosity. Because every showcase brings the very latest news and values from Woodward's. Sale events, fashion statements, ideas for the home, great buys for the whole family and more. All year round, you'll find all that's best in the weekly Woodward Showcase. Woodward's A smile and a laugh. A helping hand. A shoulder to cry on. In good times and hard times, they had each other. Jack Nicholson, Meryl Streep, Ironweed. Starts Friday at select theaters. Check newspapers for showtimes. In a world where prices always seem to be going up, the average cost of calling overseas has just gone down. You can stretch your overseas calling dollar with rates reduced by as much as one-third. And new discount rates are available to most countries seven days a week. Staying in touch has never been more affordable. For details on rates to 150 countries, call 1-800-561-9222 for your free rate card. 
Since there's a full moon in the Kootenays tonight, our chance to observe the nocturnal activities of the Sasquatch. Oh, I think I hear him now. Wow, nice spread. What's the occasion? Oh, hi, Bob. Oh, a mating season. Moonlight music, cool crisp coconut. Get the picture. Hey, do I ever? Do you mind if we watch, or is that okay? Yeah, oh, no, Bob. Nobody watches the master at work. Uh, check out Mr. Squirrel. Mr. Squirrel. Great. Coconut beer from the Columbia Brewing Company. Brewed right in the Kootenays. I'm ready. Oh, my little mugwump. Oh, hey, no cameras. thoughts at RRSP time. The banks can offer you a 7, maybe 8% return on your money this year. You should expect a 15, even an 18% return. Get some investment advice now, instead of waiting for the deadline. Chances are excellent that your money will work harder for you. The most important tip, Great Pacific Management is for planning RRSPs and mutual fund investment for 21 years. Call 1-800-663-7544 for the office nearest you. Great Pacific Management. Well, the sports news on tonight's news hour. Here's John. Thank you, Tony. So to take a more positive approach to the Canucks' horrendous streak of 24 games with no wins versus Edmonton, that's 22 losses and two ties, let me suggest they've got one win in their last 25. The man who got it in goal for them, however, won't have his status clarified until GM Pat Quinn returns home tomorrow. He's going to try one last shot tonight at trading Richard Berdur before having to send him to the minors. Pittsburgh did that today with Pat Riggins, so count the Penguins out. Thanks to the emergence of Frank Peter Angelo with Gilles Maloche backing up. A player move was made in our town today, though, as Edmonton sent left winger Scott Metcalf to Buffalo for defenseman Steve Dykstra. The Lens say this most recent significant deal, though, was dealing with Minnesota. He was discerned in a hurry that Mo Mantha is a clubhouse lawyer and a cancer is the last thing Edmonton needs in their room. Thinking he'd died and gone to heaven, ex Montreal Canadian Keith Acton went to the Norris Division. From the basement to the league's penthouse, not only has Sather told him to become more offensive-minded than with the North Stars, Acton has the added bonus of real rivalries to enjoy. I'm a competitive person and I like to compete and to be on a winning team, a, a team that's, that has a chance, as I mentioned, to win a Stanley Cup is exciting and it gets your blood flowing and uh, you, you look forward to every day. Just like Montreal relived? Yeah, it's, it's funny you mention that. A lot of people have discussed that and I can draw a lot of parallels and between uh, to, between uh, Edmonton and Montreal. I don't think Edmonton has copied them. They're unique in their own way, but there certainly is a lot of similarity. Oilers here tonight, 7.30 on CKNW, while Quebec is down in L.A. And the games in progress include the Habs losing 1-0 in Jersey in the second. The Islanders in Toronto, 3-3 tie in the second. And Washington has blown a 3-0 lead, but they're up by one game, 4-3 in the third against the Rangers. Stay tuned as Entertainment Tonight sets the stage for the Winter Olympics in Calgary, hits Disneyland with George Burns at 92, and TV dads solve real-life problems on primetime TV. You mean this isn't for my mother? This is for me, the teenager inventor, announcing always slender, the thin maxi, for teens. Wait for your face! I can wear it with a short! And no one will know? Nobody? With new always slender protection to feet. Terrific! And the special dry weave covering keeps it cleaner and drier. Really terrific. Teen size mask. It's about time. New always slender, the cleanest, driest protection designed just for you. Be what we've done for you! Thank you. Introducing Oxidol, the first detergent with protein bleach. Oxidol with blue crystals and protein bleach is more than just detergent. It gets whites whiter than any leading detergent while keeping colors bright. Now your white From the first detergent with protein bleach, Oxidol. When a child is plugged up with a cold, they feel like they can't breathe, can't draw air into their nose, into their lungs. There is relief. When you put the vapors to work, the special medicated vapors that penetrate deep down, helping break up congestion in the head, nose, and chest to help them breathe easier again. Put the vapors to work. Vicks Vapor Rock in the original jar and glide on tube. 
Jim Patterson explodes February with a world record setting sale. 24 hours a day, 696 hours of non-stop vehicle sales excitement. All cars, all trucks, new and used. Get your name in the history books. It's your chance to be famous. Plus 2.9% financing, car phones $8.88 per month, and much more. Shop anywhere, then come to Jim Patterson's world record setting sale. We guarantee a better deal. 2.9% financing, car phones $8.88 per month, and history of the making. Jim Patterson exploding all records. Main Street. George Burns, age 92, takes his act on the road to Disneyland. TV dads teach their children well in prime time. Stars return to the real world from the Never Never Land of cocaine. Sunny days for Sunny Spoon, he trades art for a badge. It's Thursday, February 11th, 1988, as Entertainment Tonight covers the beats in Hollywood. And brings you the glitz from Calgary as the Winter Olympic Games await opening ceremonies. I don't believe that. Hi, everybody. I'm John Tesh in Hollywood, and Mary joins us live today from the Great White North. Hi there, John. You know, it's the Great White Warm North right now. You know how exciting these sporting events are, and it has been years that I've been looking forward to being right here in Calgary, Alberta, Canada, which, of course, is famous for its Calgary stampede, but where now the celebrities, athletes, and television crews from all over the world are stampeding to be part of the Winter Olympic Games. There are so many emotions going on, exhilaration, tension, excitement. Starting Saturday, Calgary will be making snow and ice hot. After seven years of preparation, Calgary is just about ready for the big event. They say they have the snow they need, and if you still want to come up, there are some 370,000 tickets available to all events. Then when the Olympic torch arrives in McMahon Stadium on Saturday, the party can begin. Torch carrier Joe Chase had to wait 101 years before he experienced the highlight of his life. I think the most sudden thing that's ever happened to me in my life. For countless others, the wait is only two more days. 101 years old, isn't that great? The first televised competition, by the way, will be taking place following the opening ceremonies as the United States hockey team faces off against Austria. And tomorrow, we're going to follow Growing Pain star Joanna Kearns and get to see Olympic fever through her eyes. John? <laughs> 